This is NBN Network Media News for all races connecting you to the world. From other places. In spite of that, election did not hold in Iyala local government area, forcing the Independent National Electoral Commission to announce a supplementary poll for Iyala local government on Tuesday, November 9th. At the end of the day, it's not just the victor that's glad the election is finally over. We thank. Uh... First of all, those who voted for us, the people of Anambra State, then we thank the Independent National Electoral Commission and the security agencies. This election is the best election ever conducted in Anambra State. And we hope that um, subsequent elections will be like this or better than this. Um, there's nothing to be happy for than to glorify God. Well, this election was clearly contested. It's a relief that we have come to the end of the process. Uh, election is a process. This is the end of uh, this particular phase of it. Of course, uh, the results that we announced today uh, was not what we expected or what we wanted. Uh, for me now, we will go back uh, to our table. Our campaign will meet. Uh, and uh, the party will also meet and uh, decide what to do next. Notably, however, is the refusal of the APC agents to sign the results sheet, and the parties have different reactions to this. We don't want anybody to bring this election to this report. I've said it on Sunday um, when APC refused to sign the result. Today, APC has refused to sign the result again despite the fact that they did not win even one local government in the entire state. They did not win one local government in the entire state. So let them uh, uh, allow our democracy to blossom by accepting defeat when they lose. Where they win, people will congratulate them. I expect all the candidates to reach out to Professor Chukuma Saludo and congratulate him. That there were so many local governments like Anambra West, Anambra East, Idemili North and Idemili South uh, that were not really completed. A place like Abatete was cancelled, a place like Oba Wards 1 and 2, uh, a place like Akwaoku, a place like Ojoto and a place like Anambra West, Anambra. So we have a lot of questions, but we have to sit down and look at it and see what makes sense. The electoral body and security agencies must be giving themselves a pat on the back for successfully conducting the 2021 governorship election in Anambra State against all odds. It's not exactly clear, however, if all the parties in the contest share in that sense of fulfillment.